What's up, Gymshark? It's your boy, Connor. With Stan. And we're going to be taking you through today a 10-minute core workout. Now, this is super simple. We've got five exercises, and we're going to do them twice through. The first time, 30 seconds on, so you can learn it. And then that 30 seconds off, you'll learn the next one. And then the next round, we're going to add 15 seconds of work. So it's back-to-back -back core exercises. 10 minutes is all you need to feel a lot of pain. Ain't that right, Stan? Yes, abs going to burn. Yes, it really will. Right, lie down on the floor for me. So, first exercise is going to be a half dead bunch. So we're going to lie back on the floor, hands behind the head, and we're just going to crunch the abs up. Now, legs are in tabletop. One at a time, we're going to extend the leg forward and then return it to the tabletop, okay? So you don't extend the other leg out until you bring it back in, all right? So this is exercise number one. We're going to go in five, Gymshark. Four, three, two, one. So lift that head up, look down that torso, boom. And all you're trying to focus on is driving that lower back into the floor every single time you extend that leg, okay? That is what's going to strengthen your core, your ability to execute exercises like this while keeping that lower back driven into the floor. Now, you're only here for another 10 seconds. It's that easy. And then you're going to get a 30-second break while we learn the next exercise. We go for four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Good stuff. All right, feet down on the floor. Now the next one, we're just going to prop ourselves up on our elbow. We were going to do a different exercise, and then me and Stan were practicing it, and every time we lifted our hips off the floor, our backs, there you go. <laughs> exactly. It made a fart sound on the mat. So to save your ears from a million fart noises, we're actually just going to prop ourselves up on our elbows. So now legs are out straight. You're going to bring both knees into your chest, and then extend them out and lock them out. Okay, we're going to go in three, two, one, prop yourself up, bring the knees in as far as you can and extend those legs out. If you want to, you can do it with your back on the floor, okay? But if you're topless, everybody in the gym is going to think that you're farting every rep, okay? Bring it in, good, extend it out. Bring it in, extend it out. Nice, we've only got 10 seconds here. Doing multiple core or ab exercises back to back with not much recovery is really hard, okay? So you're really gonna feel this by the end of the workout. Three, two, one, good stuff. Right now, feet on the floor, lie back, arms up in the sky nice and straight. All you're gonna do is shoot all the way up and then you're gonna control it back as slowly as you can, vertebra by vertebra, okay? That's gonna happen in 15 seconds. Try and shoot up as much as you can and then control it on the way back. Stan's gonna show you. Everybody's gonna go in five, four, three, two, one. So shoot up as hard as you can and then control. See how slowly you can control it down. It's not about how many reps you do in the 30 seconds. It's about how slowly you can control and curl that spine down. If you look at from the side, you see how every single vertebra of Stan's back individually touches the floor. <laughs> That is down. Painful, isn't it? All right, we go for seven. We got six. We got five. Give us one more. We go four, three, two, one. Good stuff. All right, two more exercises. Sit up. We're now going to take it to a V-sit hold. So feet are off the floor here. If you have lower back pain, just keep your heels on the floor like that and lean backwards. But if you're all right, take your feet off the floor. Hands here. Now try and tap that elbow on the floor behind your back. Bam. Okay, that's your Russian twist, okay? You're gonna go right, boom, left, boom. 30 seconds there, 30 second break. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go, Gymshark. Tap that. Take it nice, slow and controlled. Core exercises, it's not really about doing a million reps, okay? Core exercises are about having the ability to control your body throughout a slow moving exercise. The more control you have, the more of that core you're gonna be working. Boom, we've got seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ouch. I'm impressed with how much you can talk during these insanely hard workouts. <laughs> That's a uh, mad respect there. I'll tell you what, it's hard when you start lifting dumbbells and throwing them around, talking at the same time as trying to breathe. <laughs> it's not the one. All right, one more exercise. You ready? So we start in a high plank position, and all you're going to do is walk those hands out as far as you feel comfortable. So all of the weight is in your core and not so much in your shoulders, okay? So get ready. We're going to go there. Three into 
in one. So take your knees off the floor. Walk those hands out as far as you can. And now just hold in that position. Now you've got 20 seconds here. If you can creep those fingers out a little bit more, do so. Make sure your legs are nice and wide. Hold it there. You've got 10 seconds. You've got your last 30 second recovery coming your way. After that, it's 15 second break only for the last five minutes. Here we go. Three, two, one. Drop the knees. Ooh, okay. Halfway through. So that was actually the easy round. So we're now going to add 15 seconds of work time onto every single exercise, and we've only got a 15 second break. It's going to burn. It's going to be worth gonna it. It's going to burn. There's only five minutes left. Exactly. We will survive. Okay. So get ready. Back to the beginning for me. So if you remember, it's arms behind the head, lifting your head up, looking down that torso, legs in tabletop, extending one leg at a time. You ready, Jim Shark? Three, two, one. Let's rock and roll. Now, remember what I said about taking it nice and slow. Your focus here is breathing out as the leg goes out, driving that lower back into the floor. If you can't get your leg all the way down to the floor, that's fine. Just extend it as high as you can while still being able to keep the back on the floor. If you're really strong like Stan, you can get that leg right down to the floor while still keeping that lower back on the floor. 12 seconds. You're shaking already, are you? Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> this is going to be good. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. 15 second break. Use it. You're going yeah. to need it. <laughs> Absolutely. Breathe. Okay. Prop yourself up on those elbows. So you're not going to want to try and do a million reps in this sport. No, seconds, no. Are you? Control. Three, two, one. Let's rock and roll. Bring the knees into the chair. Boom. And then control it out. Notice how we're holding for a split second at the top of the movement just to really hold that contraction. That contraction is where the magic is happening, okay? So don't waste that contraction. Hold it, boom. This hurts already and we're only 15 seconds in. Crazy. I said to Stan before we started, I was like, this is really simple, it's not very hard. I'm regretting it, <laughs> regretting it. 15 if you're, seconds. If you're struggling, we're, we're as well, so no worries. <laughs> yeah, we're struggling with you. 10 seconds. You got that 15 second break coming your way. We go for four, three, two, one. Oh, okay, chill, 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 chill. Okay, the next one is that straight arm sit up. Now this is one where you can do really minimal reps. You can do one rep every 15 <laughs> seconds and only do three if you want. In fact, that's exactly what Stan's gonna do. Here we I go, three, change. two, one, shoot up. Good, right, you've got 15 seconds to control it down. So do as you can. Yes, look at that control, a bit further. Boom, yes, yes, yes. Touch the floor in five, four, three, two, one. Let's rock and roll. Number two, bam, good. See if you can control it down for 15 seconds. And me and Stan, don't worry if you can't. You'll get there. Ah, we go. Five, four, three, two, one. That's really hard. Let's go. Hop. You got 15 seconds left. Let's get one more. You should be shaking. That is normal. Oh, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, wow, that hurt. All right, two minutes left. That is it, two minutes, okay? So we've got that Russian twist. Again, heels on the floor if you need to. If not, take your feet off the floor to make it harder. We're gonna go in three. We're gonna go in two. We're gonna go in one. Boom, let's rock and roll. Good, now slow as you can. Really try and rotate that torso. Okay, what we're not doing is just popping the hand either side. You've got to twist that torso in order to hit those obliques. You've got 30 seconds left here. Okay, if it starts to get really hard and you think you're gonna drop out, tap the heels on the floor, totally fine. Continue the rest of the movement with your heels on the floor. As long as you're still moving, we're happy. 15 seconds, let's go. I just use that example of if you're struggling to just do it myself. Yeah. <laughs> just put them. Put your heels on the floor, exactly. That was just an excuse for me to yeah. put my heels on the floor, to be honest, guys. Three, two, one. Okay, last one. 45 second star plank. Really test yourself on this one. When you get comfortable, creep the hands a little bit more. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, 
One, give me that high plank. Now walk those hands out as far as you can. Even further stand, even further stand. Yes, yes, yes. How much do you dare to go? If you're feeling like it's still quite comfortable, if you're not shaking, inch out a couple of centimeters even more. You've got 30 seconds here to not drop your knees. Look at that. Barely, barely in a plank. He is literally hovering off the floor. It's giving Spider-Man vibes. Right, you've got 15 seconds. Can Stan hold it with my foot on his back? For the next 10, Gymshark, hold your knees off the floor. Stan, hold it. We go seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Smashed it. Well done. That was good. Good stuff. <sighs> Guys, that was your Gymshark 66. 10 minute core class with me, Connor. And oh, Stan. And Stan. That was, that was enough core for the entire year. You guys did amazing. <laughs> Let's yes. go. Come back and revisit that class as many times as you can. Each time you can creep that star plank out a little bit further. Yes. Guys, hope you enjoyed it. See you soon.